Yo, what's going on YouTube? I'm going to dedicate this video to a good friend of mine uh, from Minnesota. His name's Jeff. He lives outside of Duluth. Haven't seen him for many, many years. Uh, I just want to make a quick demonstration video uh, about uh, Cody on, on an Amazon Fire Stick. All the Fire Stick is, is it's, a, it's like a USB dongle, kind of like Chromecast. Um with its own remote and it plugs right into your HDMI port. I'm going to plug this back in and I'm going to switch to a different TV set because uh, I get a better TV set to, to demonstrate the rest of the video. But as you can see, it's got a dedicated power supply and a uh, HDMI dongle that um, you can stream, um, you know, through your Wi-Fi, uh, streaming movie, live sports, um, music, whatever. So I got this Amazon Fire Stick plugged into my uh, flat screen TV set in my living room. And uh, I'm just going to show you real quick. I'm going to go to the home screen of Amazon uh, Fire Stick. And, and that's, this is, you know, Amazon Fire Stick. It's got all their preloaded stuff. You can, you know, rent movies from them and all that stuff for, nine, you know, six bucks a piece or whatever they charge. It's got Netflix on there and different stuff, but I did some research and and you can you can uh, push this uh, program called Cody onto an Amazon Fire Stick, and this is Cody. Okay, so what Cody is, it's like a a, a media manager, if you will, um, in which you're looking at links online on your TV set. Uh, for different, you know, movies, um, live streaming, sports, um, and what have you. And uh, you could put your, if you had a hard drive hooked up to it, um, I, there is a way to, like, uh, network uh, the Fire Stick to your PC and use that as, like, a PVR, if you will, or DVR, whatever you want to call. So you can network your family pictures and videos and music and all that and play it through wirelessly through your home router onto your tv set and home entertainment system um, so it's got a place for pictures and videos music you can stream music and programs like you you could put the old school nes games and whatnot on here if you if you really want to um but i mainly use mine for videos i'm trying to get the wife to cut the cable and I think this is a pretty good alternative. Uh, Cody's got this uh, add-on called Genesis that I like a lot. And what it is, is uh, it's all the movies and all the TV sets like ever in the history of, of television and cinema, really. Um... And it's got, you know, breaks Genesis breaks it down for you. Movies, TV shows, channels, My Genesis, latest movies, latest episodes, tools, and search. Um, I generally, like, I've, I've been watching a lot of TV lately. Um, and the great thing is sometimes it's like TV from 10 years ago, much like uh, Netflix. So if you tick, pick TV shows, it breaks it down by uh, genre, year, networks, people watching most popular, you could search by actress, whatever, uh, most popular, I'll, I'll cho choose that, and these are the most popular TV shows out, it's got Doctor Who, Big Bang Theory, Law and Order, Game of Thrones, The Simpsons, Heroes, Grey's Anatomy, Empire, Rosewood, um, Limitless, Fear of the Walking Dead, I've been watching that, the few episodes, I'm, matter of fact, I'm going to watch that pretty soon. Um, and so on. And the cool thing is, if you go back to the previous screen, let's say you want to watch a, a TV show from when you were a kid. Um, one uh, TV show that I used to watch was Spectre Man. Uh, if it's online, it's on Cody. That's the beauty of it. So I'm going to type in Spectre Man. And the remote that you get from... Uh, with the Fire Stick is kind of janky. Uh, I've heard that you can um, download an app for your phone 
uh, Cody remote and it's much nicer but um, Spectra man Spectre man was like an old Japanese like King Kong type of movie see if that comes up uh, done uh, it didn't come up with anything okay let me think of something else um, gosh TV show from the 70s from when I was a kid let's see uh, BJ and the bear so I'll just type in BJ and okay that didn't come out very nice. Uh, B J and sometimes you could just put like a word or two and it'll it'll find the rest, but in this case I think I'm gonna have to type in the whole thing. BJ and the bear. Eh, nothing. Okay, I'm a liar. Um, let's see. I can't think of it. I'm having a brain fart. Uh... All right, mash. You pull up mash, and there's mash right there. And you select mash, and it asks you, okay, do you want to watch season one, season two, season three, season four, season six, season nine, or season 11? Um, similar for movies. Movies, you select most popular. And there's all the, the most popular movies out right now. Now, some of these are bootleg movies. Like, you'd, you know, see you know people burning DVDs, pass them around, and you see people's heads bobbing and weaving in the theater. But some of the stuff, like San Andreas, that's not even out in the, um, on DVD yet. And you select San Andreas... And it'll pop up like a whole bunch of different links. And I'm working over my Wi-Fi. I don't have the most powerful Wi-Fi, but it does stream pretty good once you get a good link. So it takes a little while after you select it, and then it'll pop up with like numerous links. So there's all the links I have. Um, it's got HD... HQ on the end stands for high quality and generally you just pick a link and if that link doesn't work you go to the next link if that link doesn't work you go to the next link HQ is high quality and you scroll all the way down into the hundreds and you got medium quality uh, there's low quality um, everything and sometimes you know on the first like 10, 15 links, if that doesn't work, I'll go down to the next one, you know, like, I'll go 30 down to, like, a high quality, and that'll stream better, um, you can also search by, uh, by actor or actress, like, if you want to see every movie that, uh, let's see, I think her name's Marissa Torme, Tome. I'll just type in Marissa. I think it's two S's, maybe. Done. Nope. People search, sorry. You know what? I know how to spell her. Uh, no, I don't know how to spell her last name. Marissa. You do the people search, and then there's all the people named Marissa. 
Now the actress I'm looking for na for is Marissa Torme Tome. And darn it, I don't see her. I probably spelled her name wrong. Anyways, you get the idea. Um, another cool add-on is Sports Devil. Sports Devil, like if you're, you know, I live in Chicago, but if like, let's say I'm a um, New Orleans Saints football um, fan, and it's Sunday, and you know I can only get Chicago Bears here, so on Sports Devil, you can browse like any um sports game going on in the world really including pay-per-view um and it's really cool for like the pay-per-view sports because you're looking at like european um you're looking at like european like british tv shows uh And basically, you know, you're streaming from, from UK um, TV shows. And it's got, like, the British commercials, all that good stuff. But really cool stuff. I believe this is the future of, of television. Um, the streaming sports, the quality um, isn't the best sometimes. It's like what you would get on an analog TV. Um but, I mean, it's free. It's free pay-per-view, free, you know, sporting events around the world, and it's cool stuff. Anyways, YouTube, next time, peace out. See ya. Bye.